Hey YouTube, I just wanted to come out here and uh, show y'all a few things, but uh, on a side note that I have been kind of dealing with a lot of stuff um, here lately, personal stuff, family stuff, and um, I have yet to get my video that I've been working on out, but I had one of these spur of the moment videos. Came out here to do some gardening yesterday just to get my mind off some things and to get some veggies picked for my mom. Um, but I came across something in my garden and instead of making you wait for me to post that video, I felt like that would, I was really excited about it and I just felt like I needed to get that one posted first. Um, so I skipped my videos and went straight to this one. So thank you for watching this and uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. It is a short video, so I uh, appreciate you watching. Uh, just uh, know that I've been dealing with quite a bit and I haven't really been able to think straight, I guess, to get some videos posted. So just so a lot of it's meant to be funny. Okay, so yesterday, was it yesterday? I was able to get out here and do, um, put some BT out before, well, no, I put, okay, yesterday. It was yesterday, guys. Keep up. Yesterday, I was able to uh, put some BT out in right before it rained. No, it was not yesterday. Tuesday. That was yesterday. Didn't you know it was yesterday? Yeah. Okay. So... Tuesday, I got out here. It wasn't supposed to rain until like late, but I've been having issues with some tomato hornworms and um, having to go out there and pick them off and everything. And then you don't really, you can't see them unless you're out there with a black light in the evening time, but, which I'm not because I'm trying to get other stuff done. Uh, so I'm not able to just stand, stand out there and pick off pests. Um, but I do try to go out there and pick off pests uh, when I can. But I went out there yesterday Mom, it was yesterday. And got some BT in my sprayer bottle. And I went out there and sprayed my entire garden. Um, I sprayed uh, really heavily on my tomato plants. And then I go out there today. And I'll have to show you what they look like. And BT kills a tomato hornworm. Hornworms were most definitely harmed in the making of this video. I support this message. And my tomatoes that's grown beside the house are, have yet to get uh, aphids. On a side note, <laughs> and they're growing really well. These are uh, San Marzanos, so I'm fixing to have to pull this one up and pin him up. He's falling over. Uh, but I've got uh, three San Marzanos and a brandy wine, and these are starting to look really well. I need to get in here and weed a little bit, um, but they're starting to grow. There's my kitty kitty. Say hello, Raven. Meow. 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 He likes to bring me Mises. I came out here just to kind of look to see what I can pick. And I got to looking, and there's two tomato hornworms that are dead. <laughs> two tomato hornworms that are dead from spraying the BT on it yesterday. There's one, and see, I, I, I noticed the black, and I was like, what is that? It's a tomato hornworm that's still just hanging on, but he's dead. Like, he's fixing to fall off. But I was trying to see. But he's, see, he's black. He's not that bright, vivid green. And then there's that one. I don't know where the other one went. There was two of them. Maybe it already fell off. Oh, there he is. And this one's laying on top of the tomato. But he's all dead too. And that's what BT does to them. They demolish a tomato plant overnight, but that BT, it kills them. But right now, I'm dealing with these suckers. And literally, they're suckers. These are leaf-footed beetles. 
or bugs and uh i can't what i've been doing is just keeping a bucket of soapy water out here and when i come out here i um i throw them in the soapy water um but i didn't bring one with me when i come out here to show you the hornworms but they're just all over the place and um i was told to use diametaceous earth i think that's an aphid something there not sure what that is that or it's a I don't know. I don't know what it is. Um, but I've got aphids and I've got, uh, which there's not so bad on the aphids, but I've got these leaf-footed bugs flying all over the place. And uh, so I've got to figure out what to do with them. And I think diametaceous earth is one of the things you're supposed to put with them on the plants. But I've found a couple of ladybugs recently, and I don't really want to put diametaceous earth on my tomatoes because I don't want to kill the ladybugs. Even though there's only a couple that I've seen. I don't know what to do. Maybe I should just go ahead and put the diametaceous earth on here. And, <coughs> since there's only like two ladybugs that I've seen. I just don't want to run them off. But I don't haven't seen any more tomato hornworms. See, there's a ladybug. Yeah, that's a ladybug. Ladybug. Yeah. So I've been trying to leave them little guys alone. But those are the only two hornworms that I've seen that have been on my tomato plant and then died from the, uh, BT, the Monterey BT that I sprayed on it yesterday. So there you have it. Monterey BT will successfully kill tomato hornworms. Thank you for watching this video. Thank you for joining us. Thank you for uh, subscribing and uh, being a part of our YouTube family. Um, but I was going to ask, I'm a Christian. And Marcus is Christian, and we believe in the Lord Jesus Christ as our Lord and Savior. So if you believe in the power of prayer, if you would, just send us some prayers my, our way. Um, it's, it's my immediate family that's needing a little bit of prayers. Um, we've got a lot of things going on at the moment. Um, but if you would, just send some prayers our way. It would be much appreciated. And you have a great day.